Welcome to Solid Camp Professor. I'm Sydney, your Solid Camp Professor, and in this session we'll be showing you the new options in Clear Offset in Solid Camp 2009. If we take a look at this part that we have on our screen, I have to mill out these steps around the part itself. Now these steps are relatively wide, and the tool that I'll be using will be a 10 millimeter end mill, which is not wide enough to cover up these, the entire floor of these steps over here. So what I've done here is as follows. In the operation, I've chosen my geometries to be those single lines over there. And in my technology area, I've used the option of clear offset like we've had before, setting every 35 millimeters, from the, uh, starting from 35 millimeters out and stepping in every five millimeters. Now we have new options here called complete Z level and then also sort by chains. Let's first do this without doing any of these options and see what the results of this is. When I go into my simulation and I'll use the solid verify simulation, you'll see that the tool, now just one step at a time, goes down, clears, goes back, steps down another step down, until it gets to the bottom and then goes over to the next step. And this works on every single one of these steps as we go along the part itself, as shown here. Now let's take a look when I start changing some of the options. The first option I'd like to change is complete Z level. What will happen now is it'll first complete the Z level on every one of these steps, including this one, this one, this one, and that one. It'll and then go down to the next Z level. When I do save and calculate, and we take a look again at our simulation using Solid Verify, if you see what happens right now, I'll do this one step at a time. It's going over completing that Z level, and then going over to the next step, completing every single Z level until it gets to the very bottom of all the parts itself. Now, the other option I can actually use over here is something called sort by chains. This, together with the complete Z level, will do the following. It'll finish the Z level on that particular chain, but since I'm sorting the chains out, it'll first complete that in ch entire chain and then only then work over to the next one. Let's take a look how this works. If I go into Simulate and use Solid Verify, you'll see that the tool goes down, cleans the entire Z level on that step, but now this time it'll stay on this step at the next Z level, completing every single step, every single level on that step. And when it completes that, it works over then to the next one, completing the Z level on, the, on that particular step. And the same thing with the rest of my steps on this part itself. Thank you for joining us on Solid Camp Professor. Take care and have a nice day.